A massive volcanic eruption could be just around the corner. Are we prepared? Scientists are sounding the alarm about a potential eruption that could change everything. From deadly ash clouds to global temperature drops, history has shown that volcanic eruptions can disrupt life in ways we never expected. But where will this eruption happen? How bad could it be? And what does it mean for you? In this video, we'll explore the latest warnings from scientists, the hidden signals beneath the Earth's surface, and why some experts believe we're overdue for a disaster on a scale we haven't seen in centuries. Could this be another Mount St. Helens, or even worse, a supervolcano like Yellowstone? Stay tuned, because what we uncover might just change how you see the world beneath your feet. Something is stirring beneath the Earth's surface, and scientists are growing increasingly alarmed. Volcanologists around the world have been closely monitoring seismic activity, gas emissions, and ground deformations, key warning signs that a major eruption could be on the horizon. While volcanoes are unpredictable by nature, recent data suggests that some of the most dangerous ones, such as Yellowstone in the U.S., Campi Flegre in Italy, and Sakurajima in Japan are showing signs of heightened activity. Even more concerning, experts warn that a major eruption, possibly a once-in-a-century event, could happen much sooner than we expect. One of the clearest warning signs is the increase in earthquake swarms near active volcanoes. These tremors, often too small to feel, indicate magma is rising beneath the surface. Scientists have recorded an unusual uptick in these swarms in several regions, signaling that pressure is building. In addition, changes in gas emissions, especially rising levels of sulfur dioxide, suggest magma is getting closer to erupting. Satellite images have also captured ground inflation, meaning the land is physically bulging as molten rock pushes upward. These are all red flags that something big could be coming. But just how accurate are these predictions? That's the tricky part. While scientists have made significant advancements in volcano monitoring, pinpointing the exact moment of an eruption remains a challenge. Some volcanoes rumble for years without erupting, while others give little warning before blowing their tops. However, experts agree on one thing. When the signals start adding up, it's only a matter of time. The real question is, are we prepared for the impact of such a catastrophic event? Let us know in the comments. Do you think we should be more concerned about volcanic threats? And don't forget to like and subscribe for more deep dives into the world's biggest natural disasters. Beneath our feet, hidden from view, lie some of the most powerful forces on Earth. Supervolcanoes. Unlike regular volcanoes that form towering, Peaks, these silent giants lurk beneath vast landscapes, their immense power concealed beneath the surface. Scientists have long feared that some of the world's most infamous supervolcanoes, such as Yellowstone in the United States, Campi Flegre in Italy, and Toba in Indonesia, could be inching closer to another catastrophic eruption. These behemoths don't erupt often, but when they do, the effects are felt across the entire planet. And now, signs of unrest have some experts wondering, are they waking up? To understand the true scale of these sleeping monsters, we need to look at their past. Around 74,000 years ago, the Toba supervolcano erupted in what is now Indonesia, spewing so much ash and gas into the atmosphere that it triggered a volcanic winter. Global temperatures plummeted, crops failed, and some scientists believe the event nearly wiped out early human populations. Yellowstone, one of the most famous supervolcanoes, last erupted 640,000 years ago, covering large parts of North America, in ash. If it were to erupt again today, entire cities could be buried, air travel would grind to a halt, and food supplies could be devastated as farmland is choked under layers of volcanic debris. But the real nightmare scenario isn't just regional destruction. 
its global catastrophe. A supervolcanic eruption would blast billions of tons of ash and gas into the stratosphere, blocking sunlight for months or even years. This would trigger a sudden drop in global temperatures, leading to mass crop failures and worldwide famine. The very fabric of civilization, dependent on stable climates and food production, could be thrown into chaos. Could we survive another supervolcanic winter? And more importantly, would we even see it coming in time to prepare? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. And if you're finding this fascinating, don't forget to like and subscribe for more insights into Earth's most extreme events. In April 1815, Mount Tambora in Indonesia unleashed one of the most powerful volcanic eruptions in recorded history. The explosion was so immense that it ejected nearly 100 cubic kilometers of ash and debris into the atmosphere, darkening the skies and lowering global temperatures. The following year, 1816, became known as the Year Without a Summer. Crops failed across Europe and North America, leading to widespread famine, food riots, and economic collapse. It was a disaster that reshaped societies. And it all started with a single volcanic eruption. Now, scientists warn that a similar or even larger event could happen again. If a major volcano were to erupt today with the same force as Tambora, the consequences could be even worse. With a global population exceeding 8 billion, modern agriculture depends on stable temperatures, predictable rainfall, and international trade. A sudden drop in temperatures, even by a few degrees, could lead to massive crop failures. The world's food supply chains, already fragile in many regions, could collapse, triggering widespread hunger and political instability. Imagine waking up to a sky dimmed by volcanic ash, where summer feels like winter, and nations scramble to secure dwindling food resources. But could we really see a repeat of 1815? The unsettling truth is that we might not even need a supervolcano to trigger a similar crisis. A large-scale eruption from a volcano like Mount Fuji, Iceland's Katla, or even a restless giant like Campi Flegre could pump enough sulfur and ash into the stratosphere to disrupt weather patterns worldwide. The question is not just whether it will happen, but when. Are we prepared for another year without a summer? Drop your thoughts in the comments, and if you're fascinated by Earth's unpredictable power, make sure to like and subscribe for more mind-blowing science. Around the world, certain volcanoes are ticking time bombs, showing signs of growing unrest beneath their surfaces. Scientists closely monitor these hotspots, tracking underground pressure, seismic swarms, and the swelling of magma chambers. While we may not know exactly when the next mega eruption will strike, experts have identified the most dangerous volcanoes that could unleash devastation on a massive scale. At the top of the list is Yellowstone, the infamous supervolcano in the United States. Its magma chamber is so vast that if it erupts, it could bury large parts of North America in ash and disrupt global weather patterns for years. While it hasn't erupted in over 600,000 years, recent ground deformation and heat fluctuations remind us that it is very much alive. Across the ocean, Campi Flegre, a supervolcano near Naples, Italy, has been experiencing increased seismic activity. This densely populated region could face a catastrophic scenario if an eruption occurs, forcing millions to flee and blanketing Europe in volcanic debris. Meanwhile, Sakurajima in Japan and Katla in Iceland are already showing signs of restlessness. Sakurajima, one of the most active volcanoes in the world, has been steadily erupting in small bursts, but a larger explosion could trigger tsunamis and widespread destruction. Katla, often overshadowed by its famous neighbor Ejafjallajökull, has been experiencing deep tremors, 
an indication that pressure is building beneath its ice-covered crater. A major eruption here could release massive floods from glacial melt and disrupt air travel across the northern hemisphere. So, which region is most at risk? While no one can say for certain, the patterns are clear. Volcanoes across the globe are awakening. Could the next major eruption happen in our lifetime? And if so, will we be ready? Let us know what you think in the comments. And if you want to stay ahead of the next big disaster, make sure to like and subscribe for more incredible insights into Earth's most powerful forces. It sounds like something out of a disaster movie. One volcano erupts, and suddenly others around the world begin to follow, unleashing a chain reaction of destruction. But could this really happen? Scientists have long debated the idea of a volcanic domino effect, where one massive eruption destabilizes the Earth's crust enough to trigger others. While it's rare, history suggests that volcanoes may not act in complete isolation. In certain conditions, an eruption could set off a sequence of geological events with global consequences. One of the most intriguing theories comes from evidence of past mass extinctions. Around 250 million years ago, the Permian-Triassic extinction, also known as the Great Dying, wiped out nearly 90% of all life on Earth. Many scientists believe this was caused by massive volcanic activity in Siberia, where an eruption of unimaginable scale released so much carbon dioxide and sulfur dioxide that it triggered rapid climate shifts. Some experts theorize that this eruption may have weakened the Earth's crust, allowing magma to surge in other locations. Could the same thing happen today? There's also the concern that certain volcanic regions are interconnected. In places like the Pacific Ring of Fire, where multiple tectonic plates meet, stress from one eruption could potentially influence others nearby. A massive eruption in Indonesia, Japan, or the west coast of the United States could cause shifts deep underground, potentially destabilizing magma chambers elsewhere. If enough major eruptions occurred within a short period, the amount of ash and gas released into the atmosphere could trigger a volcanic winter, plunging the planet into darkness, cooling temperatures, and disrupting ecosystems on a scale we've oh far fu never seen before. While scientists assure us that global volcanic chains remain unlikely, the idea is not impossible. If one eruption were powerful enough, could it set off a chain of disasters that spirals out of control? Could we be on the verge of another mass extinction? Share your thoughts in the comments. And if you're enjoying this deep dive into Earth's most terrifying forces, make sure to like and subscribe so you don't miss what's coming next. If a massive volcanic eruption were to happen tomorrow, would we be ready? History has shown us that large-scale eruptions can wipe out entire cities, disrupt global food supplies, and even trigger long-term climate shifts. Yet, despite all we've learned from past disasters, many parts of the world remain dangerously unprepared. While we can't stop a volcano from erupting, we can take steps to survive the chaos that follows. Looking back, we can learn valuable lessons from past eruptions. When Mount Vesuvius buried Pompeii in 79 AD, thousands perished because they didn't know the warning signs. In 1815, when Tambora's eruption caused global food shortages, people had no backup plan for a world without summer. Even in recent history, eruptions like Mount St. Helens in 1980 and Ajafyala Jokul in 2010 showed how unprepared modern societies are for volcanic disasters. If a supervolcano erupted today, it wouldn't just be a regional crisis. It would be a global catastrophe, disrupting economies, transportation, and agriculture worldwide. So, how can we prepare? Every household should have an emergency survival kit stocked with essentials, non-perishable food, clean water, protective masks for ash inhalation, 
and battery-powered radios to receive emergency updates. In high-risk areas, having an evacuation plan is critical. Knowing where to go, how to communicate with loved ones, and what routes to take if roads become impassable. Governments, too, must step up their preparedness, but not all are taking the threat seriously. While countries like Japan and Iceland have advanced monitoring systems and evacuation plans, others have ignored the risks, leaving millions vulnerable. The truth is, no one knows exactly when the next catastrophic eruption will occur, but we do know that it will happen eventually. The question is, will we be ready? Or will we be caught off guard like civilizations before us? What would you do in the face of a volcanic apocalypse? Let us know in the comments. And if you want to stay informed about Earth's greatest dangers, don't forget to like and subscribe. Throughout Earth's history, mass extinctions have reshaped life on our planet. From the dinosaur's demise to the devastating great dying 250 million years ago, these events often share a chilling connection. Massive volcanic eruptions. When supervolcanoes erupt on a global scale, they release not just lava, but enough ash, sulfur dioxide, and carbon gases to poison the air, block out sunlight, and disrupt entire ecosystems. The question we must ask ourselves now is, are we on the verge of another mass extinction? Scientists warn that our planet may be entering a new period of heightened volcanic activity. Supervolcanoes like Yellowstone, Campi Flegre, and Toba have remained dormant for thousands of years, but beneath them, magma continues to rise. Even smaller but highly active volcanoes along the Pacific Ring of Fire are showing signs of increased unrest. Could we be approaching a tipping point? If just one of these giants were to erupt, the effects would be catastrophic, disrupting global temperatures, leading to widespread famine, and triggering a chain reaction of environmental collapse. But how much time do we have? While we may not be able to predict the exact year or decade, history tells us that Earth operates on cycles, and we are overdue for another major eruption. Scientists are doing everything they can to monitor volcanic hotspots. But the truth is, we may not realize the full danger until it's too late. If an eruption on the scale of Toba or Siberian traps were to happen today, civilization as we know it, could be in jeopardy. Will humanity learn from the past and prepare for the unthinkable? Or will we, like so many species before us, fall victim to Earth's most destructive forces? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. Do you think we're on the brink of another extinction event? And if you want to stay ahead of the next big disaster, don't forget to like and subscribe. The warnings are there. The only question is whether we'll listen in time.